What's up, YouTubers? Yellowtom7 here. If you know my channel, please hit that subscribe button because I upload videos whenever I can. So, I have bad news, but I have good news. Um, we got another box from Pebblon Bryant Pro Line. It's an RSC company. 201 West Lincoln Street, Banal Line. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. California. Zip code 92. Two zero USA. Um, I couldn't find my pen, so we're just and my knife, so we're just gonna use this screw I found randomly, um, to like cut it and stuff. Cause this is, I mean, this is pretty sharp, you know. I mean, look at look at that. But and I, my dad is watching something about the Beatles upstairs, and I didn't want to copyright things, so I just turned on the system music on my PlayStation. And that's what you're hearing now. Let me know if you like it, because if you do, I'll do it for the other um, unboxings I do, okay? So this is also going to be about the Traxxas. Little follow-up video. You can see it right there, okay? But for now, we're going to put the Traxxas behind me. Or right there. You know, wait a minute, let me see what I got. Actually, let's use this instead. Okay, so we're not gonna call it the little unboxing screwdriver. We're not gonna call it the little unboxing screw, we're gonna call it the little unboxing screwdriver because I'm just gonna use this from now on. Until I either buy a new knife or find mine. I'm probably just gonna buy a new one because I don't know where mine is. I take it to work and I come home and I'm just like, Ugh, I'm tired. I think it's upstairs in my room somewhere, but whatever. Um, so we're just gonna go like this. That work. That works. I mean, it's not sharp, sharp, but it works. I got my watch back. It's. Let me know if you, you think it looks good. It's a little dirty because I was at work and um, I had to clean the bathroom, but I'm not gonna go into full detail because you guys don't want to know. What kind of shit I literally find on the floor. But whatever. This is a company I'm probably not going to order directly from them anytime soon. Because they're like, oh, or, um, or they, I said, when I order from Amazon, when they usually send me some kind of like link to a page where I can track my order because I want to know where it's from and stuff like that and I I went and and it took them like three months to reply back and I understand it's California time I mean it didn't take three months it took three weeks and I understand that but it shouldn't take three weeks to for you to respond back to someone and they, they replied back to the email saying Oh, um, we, we don't, we don't have anything to do with Amazon. If you order through them, you're going to have to contact them. And for some reason, they sent me a link to their order. It's like, I didn't say I ordered from Amazon. I said, when I order stuff from Amazon, it, it comes with a link to a thing where I can, ow, where I can look at. That's not sharp enough. Or I can look at the, um, the stuff I ordered. Now we gotta get the other side. I made a new start race, guys, on GTA. You'll have to check it out. It's called T, like TCHD, Attention Deficit Crazy. It's like Attention Deficit Crazy Tuna Disorder. It's it's a little funny, but if you're not good at start races, you're not gonna get it. So, in here we have the basics, you know. We have shocks. These are from ProLine. They look awesome, I will say. Um, these are 8195 pre-assembled Pro-Spec shocks for short course rear. 
uh, some of the features are 12 millimeter big bore design, single low fusion X ring seal, low friction piston and guides, precision machine to race tolerance, easy access bleeder cap screw, low friction hard chrome shaft, optional spring rates available. So I guess see that little like nut right there. I guess I can adjust that and decide how much tension I want on it. So, um, we're going to put this one, that's the, I got the rear, and I pay, I, I didn't just get shocks, I also got a little stand. But I got rear, and these are the front, okay? Because my main problem with, the, you know, if you guys have ever watched anything on YouTube about a real F-150 Raptor, they say, from Ford's, Ford Racing, the YouTube, the available the the standard Fox Racing shocks, Fox Racing shocks, keep the Raptor from from bouncing around like a, like a a child in a bouncy castle, and I, I can understand that. Okay, so yeah, we're just gonna take the box and see the bed over. I do not sleep on this bed. I I sleep upstairs. That bed is really hard, and we're just gonna. Throw that over there. Okay, so this is a stand that I can put my RC on and work on it. I don't know why I bought this. I might return it. But um, their motto is, the slogan for Proline is, simply the fastest accessories in the world. All tires and wheels made in the USA. They have Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. And they said to... Um, they said, um, reply to them on Twitter. Well, I went to their Twitter and I messaged them and they didn't reply back to me. Okay, it says for this cutting edge de design, industry leading innovations, significantly f founded, advanced raw, raw materials, uncompromised performance, world championship results, over 30 years of racing to bring you the best. ProLineRacing.com, P.O. Box, Burbont, California. Telephone 951. 849-9781 website customer service at ProLineRacing.com there is a little sticker in there so we might put that on the Raptor this just shows um, how you can um, wheel tire gluing instructions I don't know if we're going to use that um, Um, I might save this just because it has the tire gluing instructions on it. So basically what this is, it's like a little stand for um, the Traxxas. It's actually pretty cool, I think. I don't know. I might get rid of it. We'll see. I mean, it, I thought it would be bigger, honestly. But if it does help me work on it, I can see why I might like it. So we're just going to toss the bag off to the side. Okay. Okay. So supposedly, what this will do is, I can take the Traxxas and put it on here. Okay, I guess you're supposed to do it when there's no tires on it, because the tires are still touching the ground, and that's right on the center of it. But anyway, we're going to um, take these pins off here, take the body off this bad boy and try to install the new shocks. Cause you guys know when you, when you drive this Raptor and you go around corners, it leans too much. Well, that bothers me because you flip it and you're like, oh shit. But, um, I done a few things to the Raptor. I lost a cl the clip right here for this. So um, I just put one of the body clips on there. Um, I colored this yellow. I colored that blue cause it looks dope. Um, I took a black sharp, a red sharpening you know, I've been touching up the little like scratches. You can kind of see it, I guess, on the video. Um, other than that, oh, and right here on the front, you can kind of see it. Um, like if I need to do this one, but you see how this black like tape stuff is wearing off. I take electrical tape and put it on there. And also the body got cracked there. So I put some tape on there just kind of reinforced it. I need to wash this again. As you can see, 
It's it's dirty as hell. It's like a dirty bastard, okay? Um So, um why don't we do the front suspension first because Okay, you know what we're going to do? 